Strategic Focus met with Bishop Rafael Tattil at EVA, the Global Symposium on Life in Mumbai. Bishop Rafael spoke to us about why the Parkhi of Samshabad will be inaugurated and its missionary nature. The Parkhi has many states and union territories come under its jurisdiction. Here is Bishop Rafael speaking to us about the many missionary opportunities that lie in the future for the growth of this Parkhi. I had a very long discussion with Apostolic Nuncio regarding the possibilities given to Sri Malabar Church by the provision of the new eparchy of Shamshabad. The Nuncio was telling me that this diocese is given the two-third territory of India. If you would like to know the territorial jurisdiction of this new diocese, it is a diocese covering 23 states, four union territories, two-third portion of India. And Apostolic Nunche was telling me that this is given to you not merely to take care of 130,000 migrants scattered in the Latin diocese. Definitely your diocese will have to take care of the migrants, making provisions for the pastoral care of the migrant communities. But so big a territory is assigned to this diocese because of its missionary potentials. The possibility for evangelization is huge and you should be aware about the missionary possibilities of this diocese. Shamshaba diocese definitely will have a preoccupation of taking care of the pastoral needs of our migrants. But it has a bigger need, need of entering into evangelization. We have to do missionary work to all the people, to the ends of our, 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 our country, reaching out all the people in this country, telling them that Jesus loves them, Jesus saves them, and the name of Jesus is the only name for salvation. So we have to endeavor missionary work with one heart, with one mind as an united army.